Dr. Max. What it is guys, my name is Swifters, and today I have for you all a pretty exciting video regarding Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Zombies. And in today's video we're going to be taking a look at the Blundergat from Mob of the Dead returning in Shadows of Evil. Now some of you guys may or may not know, it has been confirmed that the Mob of the Dead storyline from Black Ops 2 is connected or is linked in some way to the Shadows of Evil storyline from Black Ops 3. Like I said guys, this information is confirmed as it's actually coming from the zombie developers at Trick Studios as they did supply us this information at the zombies question and answer panel that took place at San Diego Comic Con just over a week ago. So like I said, Mob of the Dead and Shadows of Evil are connected in some way and I actually uploaded a video not too long ago discussing something that was actually found within the Shadows of Evil gameplay trailer that kind of relates to Mob of the Dead. I will have a link to that video down in the description below but like I said Mob of the Dead and Shadows of Evil are connected in some way and a subscriber of mine over on Twitter known as Jellyman tweeted me this picture that you guys are seeing on screen right now. On the left hand side we have Dr. Monty's gumball machine and on the right hand side we have the Blundergat from Black Ops 2's Mob of the Dead. Now you cannot deny the fact that the design of the Blundergat from Mob of the Dead and Dr. Monty's gumball machine from Shadows of Evil are very very similar First thing to note is the nose. The nose on both of these creatures appear to be very, very similar. Obviously on the left hand side we have a lion and on the right hand side it kind of appears to be a dragon type creature. That's what I'm kind of getting from this. So in Mob of the Dead we had those dogs on the wall, the Cerebus, the three headed dog. But it really doesn't look like a dog to me on the Blundergat. It kind of looks more so like a dragon. And then in Shadows of Evil we have the lion at Dr. Monty's gumball machine. Another thing that should be taken seriously between the comparison of these two is the eyes of Dr. Monty's gumball machine. The eyes of the lion are red, whereas on the right hand side on the Blundergat, the eyes of this creature could very well be a lion, a dragon, maybe even the Cerebus. The eyes of that creature are also red as well, and that is no coincidence. I find it very, very odd that in Mob of the Dead, the zombie's eyes are red, so are the Cerebus's eyes on the wall, and even the creature found on the upgraded Blundergat. And then again, in Shadows of Evil, Dr. Monty's gumball machine, the lion creature on the top of that gumball, the eyes on that lion are in fact red. So guys, this only leads me to believe that we could very possibly be getting the Blundergat in Black Ops 3 Zombies, or at least in Shadows of Evil, but keep in mind, this information isn't confirmed, this is all speculation, this is all coming from me, this is what I'm finding within the gameplay trailer and connecting it to things in Mob of the Dead, because like I said, it is confirmed that Mob of the Dead and Shadows of Evil are connected in some way, and I'm extremely excited to see how the storylines play out, if there are parallels between the two, but I guess we'll find out when Shadows of Evil is released and we begin to complete the easter egg and things of that nature but overall please be sure to let me know your thoughts about this topic down in the comment section below as I'm extremely curious as to what you all think. Firstly, do you guys think that Dr. Monty's gumball machine from Shadows of Evil looks similar to the Blundergat from Mob of the Dead? You guys cannot deny the fact that they do have some similarities. Also, would you guys like to see the Blundergat return in Shadows of Evil? I personally love that gun. I thought that it was a ton of fun to use. I would love to see the Blundergat alongside some new wonder weapons come to Shadows of Evil. Like I said, let me know your thoughts about that topic down in the comment section below. While you're at it, leave a like and subscribe so you guys never miss a future video upload here on my channel but I'll catch you guys in the next video and until next time guys this has been Swifters I'm out peace